Hi, a common question we get asked on dishwashers, are the shorter programs more energy efficient than the longer programs? So this is quite a common question and I must say I did cover a similar topic on washing machines a couple of weeks ago and it got a lot of feedback. Uh, I'm not sure if you've seen it but I was talking about eco washers and quick washers. I'll post a link here for that one. So what I wanted to do was to run through some of the programs, what they do, uh, what they're intended for and the cost of running each program. Although this is a Siemens dishwasher, uh, it's part of the same group of Bosch and Neff. So if you have got one of those appliances, then chances are some of the programs I talk about probably won't be too dissimilar uh, as far as the, if you have got one of those machines as well. As far as the costs involved, what I've done is I've worked out that a litre of water costs approximately 0.3 pence and a kilowatt hour of electricity at the moment is approximately 20 pence. Now I know figures will always vary and it, I mean we're here in the UK, I know a lot of my subscribers are abroad and it can vary a huge amount and even across different locations of the UK uh, but really for the purpose of this video I've worked on 0.3 pence per litre of water and approximately 20 pence per kilowatt hour of electricity. So I'm actually going to start on this program the auto 45 to 65 degree. Uh, this is a very common program on Bosch, Neff and Siemens appliances um, and the idea is that what it will do is it will send a certain amount of water through towards the start of the program and it will determine how dirty the water is, how greasy it is and it will actually adjust the temperature of the wash between 45 and 65 degrees. Now you don't know the temperature that it's working at, uh, it doesn't show you the temperature on the display here, uh, clearly we can see the time on here, uh, but on average the, the wash time will vary between 1 hour 40 and 2 hours 45 for this program but the temperature that it will operate at will have a huge impact on the cost per cycle. Just to give you an idea, if it was to run at the 45 degree temperature then that will cost you roughly 20 pence per cycle and if it was to run at the 65 degree temperature then you're looking at around 35 pence per cycle. So it's using almost double it's not quite double so going from 20p to 35 pence uh, as far as the water consumption that varies a lot so it goes from 7 litres up to 15 and a half litres so it does make a huge difference now this is probably one of the most popular programs that people will use uh, it's a good general program uh, for, for everyday washes and I suppose if you've got a mixture of different soilings on your plates and dishes then that's quite a, a good one to use. The next program on here is the intensive 70 degree program. Uh, this is really designed for heavily soiled items. So if you've done a Sunday roast, for example, if you've got a lot of greasy pots and pans or dishes with things stuck inside, uh, then that's really a, a good one to use. Uh, just to give you an idea, that will cost roughly 32 pence to, to run the cycle. Uh, it uses around uh, between 12 and 14 litres of water. Uh, so it's it, one of the, I suppose, less energy efficient programs on this dishwasher. Uh, the next one, so, well, sorry, just to say that that's two and a half hours approximately for the cycle. Uh, I'll cover some of the times in a moment, uh, talking about the different times. Uh, and the next one is the Speed 65. So this program will cost around 29 pence to run the cycle. Uh, that's really a good program, so it's going to take around an hour. Uh, so with that one, that's a good one if everything you're washing isn't too dirty, uh, and if you just want everything to be washed pretty quickly, then at 29 pence that one isn't too bad. Uh, the speed, 45 degree, so with that one that costs a lot less, that's only 19 pence. Uh, and as far as the, the time on that, as you see it's about three quarters an hour, so it's a a pretty quick wash and it's not costing too much as well. And the next program on here, the Eco 50 degree program. Now I've left this one till last because this can get a little bit controversial. Uh, a lot of people look at this and go it's, it's around five hours for the program. Uh, now for some people if you've got a busy family, if you're cooking a lot and if you're going to use your dishwasher a huge amount then five hours is, is a very very long program and the assumption is that if it's going to be on for five hours then it's going to be using a lot of water and electricity uh, but in this case you'd be wrong 
because for this program uh, you're looking around 20 pence that it will cost for this program. Uh, it's only around 0.8 kilowatt hours of electricity and it will only consume around 9.5 litres of water. Uh, and the advantage of that is it will actually soak everything for longer. Uh, similar to a, a long wash on a washing machine, uh, the, the whole washing process will take a lot longer, uh, but what you should find is that the washing performance of the longer programs like this should be a lot better than some of the shorter programs along here. So I suppose what I tried to do is to cover the cost of running some of these programs uh, but what I haven't really talked about is the washing performance. Now that's something a lot of people tend to ignore. Uh, you tend to assume that, okay, I just want to put everything on a, a 65 degree program. Uh, I just want it to wash in an hour, that's going to be fine. But at the end of the wash, when everything hasn't really washed properly, it's not as good as you really want, then that's really where you want to consider some of the longer programs, like the Auto 4565, or even the Eco 50 program. So just to run through the figures again, so the Eco 50 that was going to run at around 20 pence per cycle, the Eco 45 to 65 was going to vary between 20 and 35 pence, the intensive 70 degrees that was going to be 32 pence, the speed 65 degree that's 29 pence per cycle and the 45 degree program the lower temperature was around 19 pence. So I suppose in answer to people's question, is it more efficient or is it going to cost less for the reduced time programs? And I suppose not really. Uh, if you're looking at the, the 45 degree program, uh, that's a very quick one. Uh, so that one will cost a little bit less. Uh, but I suppose what it's proving is that that program at 45 degrees and 45 minutes will cost around the same as this program that's going to take five hours to wash and the washing performance will be a lot better. Now I'm sure some people watching this video are looking and thinking, you know, at 20, 30p, well, it's not worth worrying about. I'm just gonna stick it on a quick wash anyway. But for a lot of people, if you're using a dishwasher a lot, I know for some people using it once a day or even twice a day, then over the month and over the years and the lifetime of using the dishwasher can make a huge difference. Uh, you could be looking at several hundred pound difference uh, by changing the programs that you're using. And of course your dishwasher might not have these programs on, uh, so all I'd recommend is just getting the instructions out. Uh, I know it's quite rare for me to say, I'm not normally a fan of instructions, uh, but just get the instructions out and have a look because you'll find there should be some the energy consumption, uh, so it's the, the amount of electricity and the amount of water that each program will use. Just have a look at that because you might find that using one of the other programs could save you quite a bit of money. So I always knew this was going to be quite a quick video, uh, but I just really wanted to go through some of the different programs and the costs on them. Uh, all I'd normally say is please subscribe to my YouTube channel. Just give us a quick thumbs up, click subscribe and leave any comments below. Uh, I'm sure if it's anything like the washing machine one, I will get quite a few comments on this. Uh, where I suppose some people won't agree with some of the figures, uh, but all I've done is I've just worked it out. And on this particular dishwasher, that's roughly what it will cost. Uh, but anyway, I hope you've enjoyed the video. Just leave any comments. I always ask for good or negative feedback. If you didn't enjoy it, or if you think there's something I should have covered, then just pop it in the comments below. Anyway, thanks for watching.